Hi guys, my mom is visiting today and I'm very excited because she had agreed to show me and you how to make kartacze. Kartacze is a traditional Polish potato meat dumpling specific for northeastern region of Poland where we are from. We are from Elk, the beautiful region of Mazuria, and kartacze sometimes are called zeppelins. While there are many variations, my mom's recipe is the real traditional Polish recipe from Mazuria. So stay tuned and see how they're made. So we are making a large quantity. Feel free to cut down the ingredients in half. We are peeling about 15 pounds of potatoes. That's about 30 large potatoes. So we take about 10 potatoes and we boil them and then mash them very well. Next, you let the potatoes cool off and prepare the meat. So we have about two pounds of ground pork. You can use also a meatloaf mix of uh, pork, beef and veal. One large chopped onion, about two garlic cloves chopped, one teaspoon of salt, one quarter teaspoon of pepper and one quarter teaspoon of Miriam. And now the hardest step. You have 20 large potatoes left. You're going to have to grate them. And I have a food processor, but my mom, she believes the best potatoes are grated by hand. And the next important step is draining the water out of the grated potatoes. So we're using a cotton kitchen towel to do that. If you have a cheesecloth, you might use that too. Just don't throw out that water because we're gonna need a starch that is left at the bottom of the pot. Once the potatoes are drained, let the water stand for a minute or two. And when you toss it out, you're gonna see that there's starch at the bottom. We need to add that to the potatoes. Next, we set a large pot of water, or maybe two, and add some salt. And once the mashed potatoes are cold, we combine the two types of potatoes and make the dough. Next, we add about two tablespoons of potato starch and about uh, two teaspoons of salt. My mom has all the measurements in her hands and then mix everything very well. Now the fun part of making the dumpling. You grab about a cup full of uh, dough in your hand, make a flat pancake, uh, add a meatball inside and seal it very well. You might want to dampen your hand in water uh, just so it makes it easier for you to form like a football shape. Don't 
toss it gently in the water and continue making the next one. Make sure you never stop the boiling process. So continue making these until both mi mixtures are gone. And if you happen to have uh, like a leftover meat, uh, you can use it to make meatballs for next time. Just add an egg and uh, some breadcrumbs. So once the pot is full, you bring it to boil. And once it's boiling, reduce the heat to low and cook it on low for about an hour. Once in a while, tap them gently with the back of your wooden spoon. So as the dumplings are cooking, you can now prepare the onion and bacon which will be your gravy. So cartaccia are ready. Use your straining spoon to take them out of the water. Next, cover up with gravy and they're ready to enjoy. They're the best served hat just like that. All right, guys, so this is the Polish kartacze. While they do take some time to make, they are well worth the effort. I hope you will give it a try one day. In the meantime, my mom and I are sending you best wishes and see you in the next video. If you enjoyed this one, please give it thumbs up Subscribe to my channel. I'll be sharing more recipes in the future. Smacznego! Bye-bye!